Hi everyone and welcome. In the previous couple of videos, we have covered two things. First, how to download ModeScan64 software and how to run this software without installation. And the same for how to download more Sim64 software and how to run this software without installation. So once you open the folder, you will get exe file okay so you don't have to install this exe you can directly run more sim 64 and here you can directly run more scan 64 now in this video we want to cover how we can create a modbus tcp server using more sim 64 software okay so i want to create my own local modbus tcp server using more sim 64 software so in this video we are going to see this so first of all we have to double click on more sim 64 to run the application and then we have to press escape three times then after you can go to file create a new and you can change the starting address here so i want to change starting address as a one i want length as a 10 and i want register type holding register and my device id will be one now i want to create this kind of modbus tcp server so that is why i have to go to connection and navigate to connect and here you can see modbus tcp server so just click on this one and you can see modbus tcp server port so it's a 502 you can change the port here and you just press ok so you can see not connected now the warning is gone so our modbus tcp server is up and running okay so we have successfully created modbus tcp server using more same 64 software all you have to do is just go to file click on new okay and then after in the connection you have to go to connect and you have to click on this modbus tcp server and then you have to choose the port number after that how we can read the values in our modbus client so in our case modbus client will be modscan64 so let me open modscan64 here okay i have to press escape three times let me open more sim and more scan parallelly so here is our more sim and here is our more scan now the length is 10 and we are going to read the holding register device id 1 and the starting address is 1 then we will go to connection and then we will press on connect okay and then after ip address is my local host ip address because the modbus tcp server which i have created using more sim is running on my local system so that is why i am going to use this ip address and this port number which we have set here okay so once i press okay it will connect it to my modbus tcp server now if i change the value like 23 here and if i update then the value will reflect here now i want to simulate my modbus tcp server so if i want to simulate 40,005 holding register then i'll double click on this one and i'll press auto simulation and then i have to enable this one then after which type of simulation you want random increment or decrement i, I will choose random here and the change interval will be two seconds you can change according to your need low limit is zero and the higher value is three two seven six seven okay so once you press okay it will change the value of 40,005 holding register at every two seconds and you can see the value is reflecting in our mode scan 64 also because our mode scan 64 is a modbus client software and our more sim 64 is acting as a modbus tcp server so our client is able to read the data from modbus tcp server so this is how you can create your own modbus tcp server in our local system using more sim 64 and you can read the values of your remote or local modbus tcp server using more scan 64 software so i hope this is clear to you and if you still have any question regarding more sim or more scan then you can ping me on the telegram instagram whatsapp or also you can comment me in the comment box so we will just disconnect this one so suppose if i disconnect this one you can see connection terminated okay because we have stopped our modbus tcp server now if i connect it again on port number 502 and if i go to connection here and then if i connect here okay you can see it is connected and the value is updating here so this is how your more sim 64 work so stay tuned for the next video and we will see you in the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you